What's up guys, this is Emmanuel. Today we're gonna start some sequential LEDs for the trunk. Let's do it. All right, guys, so today we're going to install some LEDs for the trunk, some sequential LEDs. That one is going to go here in this area and it's going to turn on with the brakes and the turn signals. All right, so let's open the box first, all right? Okay guys, this is a little bit confusing, but okay, let's, let me try to explain this. The black is for the ground, the negative connection. The red one is for the positive connection. These two, you can connect them to the battery, okay? But since I already have my amplifier on the trunk, I'm gonna <laughs> connect them to the amp, okay? The next one green the green is for the blue light the next one the white the white one this uh white cable uh white is for the brake lights then the blue cable is for the turn signal for the left to right turn signal and the yellow is for the right to the left turn signal connected to the right turn signal and then the last one is the gray the gray line is for the reverse light okay so that's it that's, those are all the cables so let's connect these things all right let's do it okay so this is the strip the led strip for the trunk so i'm gonna try to hide it okay because i don't wanna put it right here and this uh, white thing is gonna be sticking out so i think i'm gonna put it like there behind the trunk and here i'm gonna put it like this like that Okay, I think that's the best thing because <laughs> I don't want this uh, strip to show. So it's gonna be behind the truck, the trunk. Okay, and the cable, I'm gonna run it. I'm gonna remove this rubber thing and put it under the this. Okay, under that. All right, so let's do that next. Okay, I have some extra cable that I'm gonna use to connect uh, to the positive and negative connection, the black and red cable. This one you need to connect them to the battery. Since I already have these cables, I'm gonna connect them here, all right?
so I turn it uh, on the brake lights so with that light I'm gonna test if it works <laughs> okay before I I this I trim anything I'm gonna test the the lights all right Okay, so I got a very good idea. <laughs> when I was testing uh, the cables, you can see, I don't know if you can see it, inside the cable, that's the connection. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna make the head, I mean the, this part, a little bit longer, and I'm gonna stick it inside there, okay? inside there and I'm gonna put a tape because <laughs> in, just in case if I want to remove the, the strip LED strip I just uh, remove it so I don't have to cut anything I just I will just make this uh, cable a little bit longer not too long just a little bit and stick it there and put a tape around it okay so remember the the cable with the black line that's the ground so connect it on the cable that doesn't have the black line okay so I'm gonna start connecting this is not that hard all right so just remember turn signal connected to the turn signal is the gray the brake is the blue in this side for the brake lights is the blue and if you want to connect the blue light you can connect it to the green in here okay the reverse you have to put it on on these lights okay on these ones but i don't know if you want to run it all the way over there <laughs> okay okay but you already saw it how it looks it's very bright Okay guys, <laughs> in here I have the resistor, so it looks a little bit uh, messy. But in this one, what I did, I disconnected this. Okay, let me show you, let me open it. It's gonna be hard to remove it. Okay, let me open this one. Okay, what I did is I put it, the cable inside of the connection, but it has to be on the gray, okay, and the one on the left side, this one. Put the cable inside and then, and then put it like that. <laughs> so it's going to be hard to put it inside the connection, but it will work. You can see it here. Oh, as you can see it right there they are already inside of the connection okay so it's a little bit hard but uh, not cutting you don't have to do any cutting at all <laughs> just stick it inside put, uh, put it the closest you can to the edge and then put it inside and that's it not cutting right so let me connect all the the one I have left okay for the one on the other side I will have to do another extension because the cable doesn't reach for the other the left turn signal it doesn't reach all the way over there okay
Alright, so the connection is there. This is for the reverse. Everything is very easy. All you have to do is leave the cable inside the connection with the plug and then uh, remember not to put it on the black uh, with the cable with the black line put it on the other one okay this one is the red one and then after you connect it just slide the connection back and that's it it's very easy all right and then i ran the cable here i was trying to run it inside this is the put it inside is a better idea but <laughs> i couldn't do it so i put it here here and then it's under that and then it's on the box okay so it's very easy so now <laughs> the final thing let's test the light this is the i'm very excited <laughs> okay so let's test it let's test the light i added a little bit of tape here so it will stay in its place okay so now let's test this thing <laughs>
Ok guys, those are the sequential LED, <laughs> they look amazing, they look great, you can see it over there, <laughs> look great, uh, but uh, I think I'm gonna disconnect the blue light, because I don't wanna get a ticket, because only the blue light, but all of them, the reverse, the turn signal and the brakes, those I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep, ok? But uh, let me know what you guys think about this, <laughs> it looks great, ok? Put in the comments. But if you like the video, please like the video and subscribe for more videos like this one. The link of the product is gonna be on the description of the video if you wanna get this, okay? And see you on the next video.